she said, this is by no means the worst storm out there, but it is the first of the season. And the folks on the coast, they're used to this, mm -hmm. and they really know how to prepare. From Astoria, our Jennifer Dowling. Jennifer. Yes, good afternoon. The winds have been kicking up here. We have the Columbia River here to my left, and you can see the white caps out there. Locals tell me that's a sure sign that the winds are here and the fall storms have begun. We also talked to residents who were securing items, putting things away in their garages so they didn't blow around. And I talked to a few tourists who are actually excited to experience this fall storm. This couple from Utah stopped in Astoria to see the sea lions. Well, that's why we pulled over. We heard them flapping from <laughs> a mile away. But they were also excited to learn that they will experience their first fall storm on the coast. We might try to venture out under the wind if it's not too bad. We'll see. I've actually got an extra pair of shoes in the car for this. We stopped to chat with local Brian Stroyan about his stepdad's Halloween decorations, wondering if they'd be secure. I know it's uh, hooked up to my brother's window up there in his room. He was confident the fishing line would hold them, adding that he expected more residents than normal to stop in at the Papa Murphy's where he works due to the forecast. Uh, we actually do get a little bit of business with that coming in because a lot of people like to get uh, pizza just maybe before the power goes out. He says grocery stores will see an uptick in business as well. Uh, usually a lot of people do do it if they go to the grocery stores and stuff like that. Uh, definitely with the windstorms coming. Oh, I got um, Rockstar, Pepsi, and um, some lunch. Tim Michelson is one of those residents who's preparing for possible power outages by stocking up. Oh, geez, it's terrible. I mean, when it blows, it blows. He says trees could come down in this windstorm as well. One time we had this really big, big storm, and all the trees were just like down. On the roads, you couldn't go, couldn't get out of town. This couple says they'll get their sightseeing done early, just in case. We're gonna leave. We're gonna go out to the to our hotel, <laughs> stay in the hotel, maybe. <laughs> so, hide out. Yeah, hide out, <laughs> hunker in. So tourists not bothered by the storm. Sea lions either. They are just out doing their thing. Not worried at all. We talked to the city manager, another person that wasn't worried here in Astoria. He said they did close down the Astoria column, the viewpoint up there because it was so windy. But otherwise, business as usual around the city with city workers on standby just in case. Back to you.